hold my hand inside your hands. I need someone who understands. Father, we thank you for this day. What a happy day. What a wonderful day. Two of your children, Jeff and Emma, we thank you for their lives that they have lived up to this point separately. And Father, we thank you for this day that we can celebrate the joining of them together before you. We thank you for their commitment to you. And we thank you for this commitment they are making today to each other. As we discussed the various strengths and weaknesses that we each bring into a marriage, um, I was very impressed with how honest and self-aware these two good-looking people in front of me are. In the course of our time together, we discussed much about marriage. We talked about how God uses marriage to make us more like Jesus, how through marriage we learn more about love, about forgiveness, about patience. On your wedding day, Jeff and Emma, I want to challenge you both to make Christ the foundation of your marriage. Make Christ the foundation of your daily lives to be utterly dependent on Jesus Christ. And I'm confident that you will do that. I now pronounce you husband and wife. What God has joined together, let no man separate. Jeff, you may kiss your bride. Jeff and Emma, please turn to face your friends and family. Ladies and gentlemen, it is my honor to present to you Mr. and Mrs. Jeffrey Bloomquist. language we have the word love but in the Greek language I believe there's four words for love I'm not going to try to say them all but the first one is agape that's God's love unconditional love the second I, I'm not I don't know the Greek word but it's a brotherly love a friendship love the third is um, a parental or a protective love and then the fourth is eros it's um, it's a romantic love and in marriage we see all four of those and today we can celebrate that with Jeff and Emma. We're so excited for them. So let's just give thanks for the food right now.
Our Father in heaven, we thank you for this day. We thank you for a beautiful day. We thank you for a, a beautiful place to enjoy this celebration. Again, we, um, we celebrate the lives of Jeff and Emma. We thank you for their families. We thank you for the lives uh, that they have lived up to this point. And this day, Father, uh, a lot of it's going to change. And we know, Father, that you've designed marriage um, to be something that glorifies you. And so we pray that in Jeff and Emma's lives, in their marriage, that you would be glorified. I promise.